Hi, my wonderful Sagges. I hope all is well. This is your next 72 hour psychic predictions. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome. I'm happy you stopped by. All right. Let's see what is going on for my wonderful Sagges. I don't know why I'm getting this, but I'm getting bobbed wire. I don't know what this is, but I'm getting bobbed wire. And I'm also getting a flash of Pamela Anderson. I have no idea what that is, but that's for someone in this reading. All right, for my wonderful Sages, what's going on? Woo! It says focus on your priorities, okay? So you are focusing on your priorities. And I'm also getting you are becoming more confident as well. I'm also getting that you're, you're um, because I'm getting that song, hit them with your best shot. Like you're 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 taking your best shot at something in the next 72. Like something about you taking your best shot at something. Okay, let's see what else. Why is this here? Why is focus on your priorities? Focus on your priorities for Sag. Why is this here? Thank you. So you have the Ace of Cups here, and then you have the Tower in Reverse. I'm getting something about a conception of a new romance. Conception of a new romance. For, okay, so what I'm getting when I say conception of a new romance is there's basically some type of new op, um, opportunity, a new relationship of some sort that's helping you avoid some type of disaster. And that's why you're focusing on your priorities, okay? You're focusing on what you de you deserve. It's something about this new relationship and now it doesn't have to be romantic though okay sag it does not mean that it's romantic um it could be some type of partnership but it's basically Ugh, i'm sorry <laughs> that message like my phone has just been blowing up it's driving me crazy i need to like turn it over okay but something about this 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 relationship or maybe even partnership is helping you avoid some type of I'm getting avoiding some type of loss. Tell me more. Avoiding some type of loss. If you are um, being intimate with a new partner, please be careful because you could be like getting pregnant because conception is, you know, we know what conception is. All right. That could be happening. Let me see. What is this about? We have the death card. And then we have the six of pentacles. There's a change in employment. That's what I'm getting here. There's a change in, in employment. Is this may be happening unexpectedly. There's a change in employment. And you're going to be letting go suddenly. Um, but this is a positive thing. I'm not getting like a negative thing. But that's what I'm getting. Um, and you, you're just focusing on your priorities. I could be because I'm getting the tower in reverse. Because I'm getting the tower in reverse, I'm getting kind of, and I'm also getting the um, image of a roll that roller coaster card in my um, other deck. Where's that deck at? I'm not gonna get it though. It's my money deck. It's like some type of. It could be some type of employment situation where it was unstable. 
it looked like it was going to be unstable, like shaky. And then all of a sudden there's something that comes in that changes. Um, that makes you feel like, oh, you know, it's, it's stable again. And I'm saying when it comes to this tower in reverse, it's, it seems like there was may have, there could have been a situation where you, you've been notified that you were going to be let go, Sagittarius, for some of you. Or you could possibly be let, letting go, let go of, like you may have been in this, this energy of panic because you're like, oh my God, am I going to find another job? Like I'm, I'm about to lose my job. Something's happening there. But then, you know, because I'm, I'm seeing like clouds. Um, for some of you, you may be feeling like you're on cloud nine with this new, this new employment. Yeah, the employment card. For me, the King of Pentacles is, is an, an employment card. And if it's not employment, then it has something to do with some type of assistance here. Some type of assistance here. I'm also getting something to do with um, something in your pocket, finding something in your pocket. I don't know what this is, but something about something being in your pocket or noticing something in your pocket. Or maybe someone will be coming up to you and being like, hey, I got this thing. I didn't even know I had this in my pocket, okay? this I know it's very weird, but that's how I do my readings. I'm getting something like that as well. I'm also getting the notebook. Um the notebook i'm seeing i'm seeing a notebook spirit saying the notebook for someone something about the notebook maybe the notebook in your pocket some something about the notebook okay tell me more what is what is sagittarius's obstacle let's see what is the obstacle in the next you're gonna have to um I'm getting that old song, how can I breathe without you? You're going to have to do something without someone. You're going to have to go about something without someone. The Queen of Cups. Clarified by the Four of Swords. For some of you, you may have to go without um, a Queen of Cups type character. There's something happening in the next 72 to a week ahead where you're like, you know what? And I'm getting that um, Puff Daddy song, Every Breath I Take, Every Move I, wait, I Make. That song that he made after Diddy passed away. Um, something about, and I'm not scared, I'm not trying to scare you. There's nobody dying. I'm not seeing anybody dying, but there's something about you having to. move away from some like do something without someone and you may have not expected that or for some of you you're just in the next 72 you're missing someone i'm also getting something about you you missing someone um this you could you could be missing someone who has already passed i'm getting because there is this energy of peace after this um, situation where you're trying to avoid some type of disaster, like I was talking about, and then like all of a sudden there's some type of sudden expected change, you get the help you need. Um, for some of you, I was feeling very strongly that it has something to do with the job. And you're happy, but there's this sense of, hey, I'm having to do this without this person. There's like this sadness, like I'm having to do this without this person. For some of you, this is the person who was deceased, okay? I send my condolences out. I know how that feels, all right? It's like, oh, I'm happy, but I wish I could do this with this person. I wish they were still here. Okay. What else is happening for my Sages? I'm going to pull from this deck right here. What else is happening for my Sages? We have child right here, brand new. So something brand new is happening, brand new. 
for some of you, you're going to be doing something brand new that you're quite inexperienced in. Like you feel like you're inexperienced. All right. Like you're like, I don't know what this is, but I'm going to go ahead and then it can be related to this job thing. Okay. Um, you're like, I don't know what this is. Um, and I'm a bit inexperienced. I feel a bit in, inexperienced I'm getting. And for others, it could be you're dealing with a child this week, some, something going on with a child. We have the tree right here, fertility. I'm getting, I'm getting there's something to do with um, you connecting to something you did in a past life. Like connecting to a past life, a life. Connecting to your past life, there's something, there's roots in something to your past life and something that seems very familiar to you. Let me take that back. You may not feel like extremely familiar with it at first because I'm getting something, something brand new and something inexperienced. But you've done it in a past life. You get what I'm saying? Like you've done it in a past life. Like it's connecting you to um, your past life. We have the hummingbird here. Now literally you may be seeing honey, honey, <laughs> hummingbirds. Okay, you may be literally seeing hummingbirds. But I feel like you are enjoying, you're, like, you're having a lot of enjoyment. I'm getting sweet goodness, okay? Enjoying the lightness of being, just being. A lot of peaceful energy around you, Sag. I love that. I'm also getting, because um, I'm going back to the child right here. There could be a child that got that receives a new pet for some of you, like a, a child that, or you're getting a new pet. Think about a, a child bringing home a new pet or something. Like, can we keep them? I don't know why I'm getting that, but I'm getting that as well for someone in this reading. That's not for everyone. Okay. What else is happening for my wonderful Sages? And we will be closing the reading. We do have feeling irritable. <laughs> Some Someone's going to have you be someone's going to have you feeling quite irritable and this could be happening on a Tuesday okay something about you feeling a little bit irritable on a Tuesday for others of you it may not be on a Tuesday but um someone does have you a little bit irritable <laughs> I don't know okay I'm getting for someone here it's like a man period I call it man period someone here is having a man period if you're a man you're having a man period where you're like moody I'm getting we have good news. You're receiving some type of good news I'm getting. And we were just talking about that. Friday is very significant. Something significant happening on Friday. What that thing's gonna be is gonna be very different for everyone. And also getting some type of support here, all right? You're gonna be getting some type of support within the next 72 to a week ahead. Now, we're going to pull a closing message for my wonderful Sages and we will be done. Spirit is saying you're the leader of the pack, okay? So act like one. That's for someone. I'm also getting, um, who's watching Grease? Someone's watching Grease that's watching this channel. I'm getting Grease, um, that old movie. You're the one that I want. I'm getting like a scene from Greece or something like that. Okay. Your final message is trust the universe. All right. Trust the universe. Okay. Where I put it. All right, my wonderful Sages, go out there and have a wonderful next 72. Bye.